Hey guys, salut mes amis, ok, hello goodbye. Maxime here. Just a couple hours ago, we got a new beta update for Panorama for bug fixes and other things. It's been a long time since I've seen Valve add so much extra stuff into something so quickly, which is really awesome to see. I'm going to look at some of the few things that are interesting to bring up and also talk about my text color mod near the end. I like pretty much everything that Panorama had to offer, but the scoreboard felt a little off, I gotta admit, and they decided to focus a lot on that. To begin with, the blur amount has been reduced. This was something I did not like so much, and I'm happy they reduced it. I would honestly like it if they reduced it even more. They added more specific row definitions for other game modes, updated the skill group icons, because for some reason they were using the old ones, they added support for major tournament names and event stages, which will be cool to see, and they fixed a couple other things. Now let's move to gameplay. They've re-added show team equipment and also a key binding to the settings menu so you can easily bind it from there. The same for show team positions in HUD under game settings. The buy menu background blur has been reduced as well, which I didn't feel was so necessarily needed since you have all the information down here, but it's still very welcoming. Health, armor, and ammo background elements are back and can be adjusted like before, so we get a bit of contrast and clarity. Very nice. And then they've updated the drop shadows from colored HUD elements. Under this part of the update, there was mostly fixes, more fixes. Oh, maybe you noticed that I didn't cover the new CZ reload animation in my previous video. Well, they changed it back to how it was before, as it was unintended. I knew that. Some people here will be happy to see that they fixed some 4x3 issues. And finally, we got some radar improvements. That's pretty much the update. Now you're probably wondering, when will Panorama be out of beta? My guess is in less than a week, but I don't work for Valve, so don't get disappointed if I'm wrong. I was right, however, about them releasing it when they did, so I guess I got some skills. Also, I do believe that more updates will arrive for Panorama before its public release, so we might see another update similar to this one. It's in everyone's interest, ours and Valve's, to release it when everything seems to be good to go. Now, I want to talk about my text color mod. So, as I suspected, Panorama kind of broke my text color mod. But not only that, they also changed some strings to make it harder for me to customize some values with HTML elements and symbols. Almost as if Valve knows about the text color mod. I had to redo a lot, but to share some good news, I'm really happy with my results so far, and I will release the latest version of the text color mod around the same time that Panorama gets released officially. Make sure you subscribe with notifications on so you know when that video comes out. You obviously don't want to miss that. Another thing I would like to announce really quickly or say, but I know some of you already know this, so it's not really a secret, but I'll be visiting ESL Cologne with my fiance and be there together with some other talented people. So if we meet in the bathroom, make sure you say hi. You can follow me on Twitter to see my internet muscles. And if you want to check out some pictures, I have Instagram. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one and go bananas.